Hey, what's going on guys? Hi Dad with another review. Today we're taking a look at Vape Tins. Woo woo! Dice que lo quiere, pero a mí me ama. Quiere estar con él, ya, pero a mí me llama. La agua es lo que and if you don't know what vape tins is it's a monthly subscription a vape subscription and uh, you get goodies every month you get juice you get mods you get coils cotton batteries i mean whatever you need uh you can go ahead and set your preferences and uh, you get what you want i want you guys to see this review through so i'm not going to give you any spoilers we're going to go through the whole thing i'm going to give you my thoughts and uh, we're going to be in and out quick easy and that's it vape tins does not sponsor this video vape tins did not send me these boxes i went ahead and ordered them myself i wanted to go ahead and take a look at them and i wanted to show you guys what they're all about according to what they're saying is that these boxes are supposed to contain hot stuff they're supposed to contain the new mods they're supposed to contain the new equipment everything that's hot in the market right now you should be receiving in these tins that's what i've been hearing i want to show you that it's all legit here's the three tins right here one two three i'll purchase this month so i'm going to make sure i make this short sweet just for you guys all right check this out this is the first tin of the month and i'm not gonna lie the tin is really nice i really like the tin it's super nice for storage uh let's go ahead and show you what came in my first tin i see fresh e-liquid caramel delight this is Kane's honeydew melon i got a little cotton bacon i got some coils and the last thing in here wake littlefoot 60 watt kit so that's what was in my first month tin now as i mentioned this is a modern tin this is the most expensive one on their subscription so as far as the tin goes it was a nice tin i mean i was i was surprised i actually liked the little foot it was nice i'm gonna do a separate review on that for y'all and overall the tin was all right I, I definitely liked it it was a surprise i haven't tried all the juices except the honeydew which i really liked and again i'm gonna do a separate review for that one uh i was looking forward to the next tin let's go ahead and take a look at it now on this one i did set preferences i told them i did not want desserts cotton i didn't want wick i did not want coils that's what i asked them for this one i also took out the starter kits i wanted full kits and squonks pj bros swirled caramel cinnamon sweet sugar cookies icy fresh e-liquid i got another set of coils also remember when i told you that this is supposed to be hot merch what's new in the market and hot right now I got a smock alien kit. Unfortunately, I, I got a, a tin that was a waste. That, that's really how I feel about this one. As far as the juices, uh, as I mentioned, I did set preferences, no desserts, and that's all that was sent. Now, this was one of the hottest mods back in the day. About three years ago, when this came out, this was hot, and it stayed hot for a while. It's just sitting there. It's been sitting there for two weeks, and I don't really plan to use it other than for the review. And that's it. Let me go ahead and show you the, the third and final tin. Cali Cooler Double Apple. I got an Elemental E-Liquid. This one's grape. Golden Ticket Chocolate Milk. I got some batteries. I already took out the other one. I'm using it right now. I definitely like those. And I got a Ram Box Mod Squonk. This is the worst 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 squonk i have ever seen it's also not hot in the market right now overall as a overall in the tins i'm not impressed i mean these mods they're not the hot hot they're not the new new i mean i thought that's what's supposed to be in these tins it's not that now i'm gonna go ahead and give them one more month in january if the tin's not good it's done man I mean, I can honestly not continue using this product or continuing this subscription when the product is just not there. They took a lot more of thought into the box, into the tin, into the design than what's actually the content of what's in there. I, I guess, I don't know if they're trying to get all their old shit out. The tin is dope, I give it a 10. The overall subscription, if you think about it, if you're only gonna get one dope tin out of 12, tens twelve hundred dollars i mean i can't even give that shit a three you know what i'm saying especially on their website on their website they have 
And the, the tins look amazing, man. When I get them in my hand, they look like shit. Like I said, I'm gonna give them one more shot. If the next one's good, we'll try another one. But at some point, it's just gonna end because it's not there. Is there another subscription that I would recommend? Hell yeah. There's another subscription that surprised the shit out of me. It's a lot cheaper. And like I said, it surprised the shit out of me. Everybody has their own opinion. Go ahead and let me know yours down below. Uh, as always, please like, subscribe, go ahead and share with your friends. I want to make sure we get those subscriber numbers up. Go ahead and follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Let's go ahead and finish this shit off with a vape and get out. It's done. Insane. Los billetes.